Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day, Episode 1. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the little bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. All right. So tonight we are going to use my TI. Okay, we honed this up last Friday. And it is, I'm going to think, be a great shave. All right. It is a uh, probably quarter hollow this is a 6 8 blade. Uh, I'm assuming, guys, this is out of the 70s. I don't know. If anybody knows uh, better what this could be, what, you know, how to date it, just please, in the comments, let me know, because I have no clue how to date this. I've been looking around, and I can't figure it out. Now, we're also going to use... Sterling Soap Company, and that is the Coconut Lime. Just a nice, wonderful, fresh lime scent. Really enjoy it. All right, and then for our brush, I've got my Omega 10098. Now, I've had the soap blooming, so we're going to pour that bloom water off and put it on as a pre-shave. All right. Mmm, what a wonderful scent. We just work that in, and it really is a nice pre-shave, guys. I, I tell you, I've been doing this for a while, and I really enjoy it. All right, now we're going to get some of that water out of that brush. Okay, and here we go. Let's load it up. All right, so tell me guys, how are you doing? Yeah, you having a good weekend? I hope so. Yeah, and hopefully some good shaves, huh? That would be brilliant. Yeah, now... I hope you liked uh, the Friday special uh, where we honed up this razor. I am really been looking forward to using it. So let's just give it a try, right? Absolutely. Now, this soap is brilliant. It This is a tallow base soap and just super slick, got a lot of cushion. It is excellent. Now I'm just cleaning up around the bowl. And now put some of that on. And like I say, a wonderful lime scent. Really enjoy this stuff. All right, now, yeah, so hopefully you guys have had uh, a good weekend so far, had some uh, time with your family, your friends, been able to enjoy and relax, I hope so, that's what I've been doing. Okay, looking good. We're going to get a little more water on this. And it's just going to come to life. All right, look at that. Wonderful.
Yeah, overdid it a little bit on the neck, but that's okay. Better have more soap than not enough, guys. All right. So now this is episode one of the Sunday Shave of the Day, which means it's with the grain. Let's go. Wow, that is nice. Nice and smooth, wonderful. All right, a little smaller blade than I'm used to, but uh, I like it. It really is nice. Nice and smooth and sharp. Oh yeah, nice. Really nice. I'm liking it. Now I have done a little bit of research on this blade and uh, it's interesting. Yeah, apparently TI uh, there in France uh, still uses a uh, lead bath, a molten lead bath to temper their steel. They have a special permit and everything for that. So it's pretty cool. You know, that's really unusual, but uh, apparently it tempers the steel in a special way. Oh, wow, look at that. I, I guess I should clean off the blade, huh? Yeah. Six eighths is, like I say, smaller than I'm used to, but it is nice. It's very maneuverable.
And uh, this is new old stock. So when I got it, it had never been used. So that's cool. And I'm assuming it's out of the 70s. It definitely is uh, one of the straightest blades that I've ever seen right off the bat. All right. Now, let's go ahead and get that washed off. See how we did. I like that quarter hollow, too. Not a lot of audio feedback, but I'm telling you, it really is comfortable. Oh, yeah, nice. All right, there you go, guys. Coming up next is a pass and a half. Click here to see that. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.